Good morning, everyone. Today I would like to introduce a new series, Colonoscopy Clowning. We'll get to the explanation of the title in a second. But first, I would like to introduce you all to consignment box scammer Jack Lewis. This scammer claimed that a box at the airport with $10 million in it belonged to me. The whole catch is I had to send a fee to collect the box. After nearly two months of exchanges, it was finally time for me to make my payment. But there was a small problem. The money transfer outlet could not allow me to send the fee unless Mr. Lewis filled out some security forms. I'll post the completed forms at the end of the video, but before that, I had to call Jack and encourage him on multiple occasions to stop being lazy. And so, on this particular day, I needed to call Jack, but there was a slight complication. In reality, I had a colonoscopy procedure scheduled for the next morning, and thus had to do the infamous Miralax prep, which involves ingesting an entire bottle of laxative. So, since I knew I would be on the toilet all night, I set up camp in the bathroom with my mic and got to work. I called Jack, and I'm almost certain he heard my explosive diarrhea splashing in the toilet. I also gave Jack a very descriptive explanation of the process. Hello? Hello? Hi, Jack Lewis. This is James. Yes, Mr. Jack. Hi, I was just wondering, how, where are you at with those forms? Are, are you still completing them? I will, I will get it done tomorrow. You'll get it done tomorrow? Yes, yes, I'll get it done tomorrow morning. Okay, that's fine. Listen, um, I won't be able to contact you for the first half of the day. I actually have to go in for a colonoscopy tomorrow. So I'm, I'm kind of camping out in the bathroom right now, actually. But anyway, uh, so just send the email with the forms when they're completed, and then I'll get back to you a little later in the day. Okay, okay, no problem, no problem. I'll get at them tomorrow. Right. How have you and been? I'll send you an email, okay? Yeah, that, that works for me. No problem. How are you and your family? Yeah, we are doing okay. How about you? Uh, I'm doing all right. Uh, I don't know if you've ever had a colonoscopy before, but the prep for it sucks. It is the most demeaning, disgusting thing on the planet. I'm, I'm miserable, but anyway, I apologize for calling you from my porcelain throne here. <laughs> wow, 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 that's amazing. Uh, how about the coronavirus going over there? Yeah, that's still going on here. They're kind of, they're laxing. How, the, how is the situation right now? Uh, it's, is it's, it getting better? Yeah, yeah, it's getting better. They, there's some areas that are starting to open back up. Here in the United States, I'm, I'm in the UK, but I have some family in the United States, and they have a bunch of riots going on right now. Well, well yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm aware of that. I'm aware of that. It's crazy, crazy stuff. Yeah, sure, sure. It's really crazy. Scary times, that's for sure. I, I don't, I don't know if you're religious, but um, we, you know, I'm, I'm Christian and definitely believe the end times well, are coming soon. <laughs> well, by God, grace, we'll get over it. I'm sorry. I said, by God's grace, we must get over it. Yeah, we must get, we must get right of it. Yeah, that's that's what I'm, I'm hoping. I'm hoping that I can, you know, stick with God and. When the rapture happens, I'll you know I'll be I'll be amongst the people that get to go. Sure, 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 sure. Exactly. <clears throat> you, how about you? Are you religious? Huh? You are. How about you? Are you religious? I'm a Christian. Good, good. It's always good to meet a fellow follower in Christ. Sure, sure, sure. You're a Christian too. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I was born and raised. Well, I thought you were Muslim. You thought you said you thought I was Muslim? Oui, oui, yes, yes. Oh no, no, no. I'm not Muslim. I'm not Muslim. I'm Christian. Oh, uh, oh, uh, that's very good. That's very good. Yeah, I, I have some Muslim friends. Uh they're I find them to be a little bit misguided personally, but you know, to each their own. Okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> no problem, I will send you an email tomorrow, okay? Yeah, yeah, that works for me. Say hello to your family for me. No problem. Thanks a lot. Say hello to your family too. Yep, yep. God bless you. Yeah, are you married? 
Are you married? Uh, I was. Not anymore. Well, well, well. That's yeah. No yeah, that was that was a rough thing. You to have go a through. kid? You have a kid? No, no, no children. I I I have some parrots. They're kinda like kids. <laughs> well, well. Very distinct. That sounds good. <laughs> Maybe someday. That sounds good. How about you? Sure, you got... sure, sure. Someday you're gonna have one. Do you have children? Yes, yes, I have two children. A daughter and a and a boy. You have a girl and a boy. how how old are they? Yeah. Uh, five, seven. Oh, you must be so proud. Five years or seven years. You must very. You must be very proud of them. I'm. I'm honestly, honestly, I'm really proud of them. I'm That's really happy about them. That's good. I'm sure they'll be. I'm sure they'll be wonderful yeah. men and women when they get older. Sure. Sure. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's what I pray for. Yep, that's all we can do is pray, right? Lead by example. Sure. Sure, elderly. Ugh, ugh this stuff is disgusting. Sure. I have to drink this, I have to drink a whole bottle of this stuff called Miralax. It's like 238 milligrams or something, and it, it makes you, it makes your entire digestive tract clean out. <laughs> Well, yeah, it sucks. I I could just about bend over and paint the wall. We'll just put it that way. Wow, well, well, well. <laughs> I probably probably a bit of an overshare. That's, huh? <laughs> that's really good. That's really good. By the time I'm done, um, let me tell you something. By the time I'm done, I could literally I could literally mm -hmm. shoot it into a water bottle and put a cap on, and you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It's so clear. <laughs> It'd be an interesting April <laughs> Fool's joke, huh? <laughs> wow. Well, uh, oh, gotta make sure I don't have cancer, good. though. Uh, okay, well, nice speaking with you today, Mr. James. Yeah, it's nice talking with you. I, I hope to hear from you soon. Mm -hmm. Sure, sure, sure. I will do that. You don't want to be on the phone for what what's coming next, that's for sure. <laughs> I'll... <laughs> God bless you. Uh, I'm gonna call you tomorrow. All right, all right. God bless you. Yeah. Right. yeah. God bless you too. All right. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Note how friendly this guy was during the call. I point this out to show that these scammers aren't always explosive. That's always my end game, but it actually requires a lot of patience and bonding with the scammer to get to that point. Without trust, you lose the fish before long. Anyways, here's those completed forms I promised. Have a lovely day, everyone, and enjoy. Enjoy.